parents so let's talk about today you are growing up teens do they have weird sense of music according to you does their sense of clothing their early interest in relationships do all these things bother you if they are bothering you there is a reason for you to think are you stuck in your growing up days are you stuck in your teens and 20s that you are expecting that your child should be behaving in the same way please think before you give an answer to this question i know every parent would say no i understand what is right for my child i give you credit for that you understand what's right for your child but please do this self examination what is it that you are expecting your child to behave in a certain age because if you are expecting that the child would wear the kind of clothes that you were wearing or the child would be not thinking or not at least expressing interest in the opposite sex just because he is in his teens or maybe that he would be listening to you all the time because you used to listen does it look sound familiar familiar to your past days that is a warning sign that i would like to give you today about your teens and your teenagers teenagers tweens teens your youth in 20s i have heard many parents saying that my child is attracted towards a boy and this is not her age to do it now interesting thing is i have had parents of a 13 year old say this i have parents of a 17 year old say this and i have even had a parent of a 20 year old say that this is not her age to do that she should be studying fantastic what is the right age to fall in love guys look around what is happening look around in today don't go back to your young age days look around today and see what's happening around your child what are the messages which are being given to your child what the what are the kind of dresses that you see in the media if you watch any of the teenage serials or watch any of the new age movie you will realize that past class 10th say be age 15 or 16 almost every youngster is shown to be smoking or at least drinking and being in a relationship and that's quite glorified now if that is kind of a behavior is glorified i am not saying it's right or wrong i am just saying this is the world that they are living in what are you expecting from them are you trying to pull your child back to your good old days or are you growing up to match up with them again parents i am not saying let them behave the way they want they are young they don't understand lot of things they would need to be guided about security and safety many times you would have to put disciplinary rules to stop them from doing something which can be harmful to them but that certainly doesn't mean that everything that today's teen is doing is doing wrong just because it does not match with what you used to do in your old age day, old days today children are opening up around them media is talking about everything and they want to talk about everything too your teenage teenager would like to talk to you about relationship your teenager would like to talk to you about sex your teenager would like to talk to you about uh, maybe some xyz uh, country which has got some weird rules now you were not comfortable talking to your parents on these uh, topics i understand but you have to now grow up to their age so that you can talk to them or at least listen to them minus your awkwardness so that they can feel that my parents understand because if you listen to them then only you will be able to understand which is the area where you have to guide them the easier way out is shut start shouting the moment your child start talking about relationships sex or any of these things so the moment you start shouting the child shuts down the topic is over forever and you are not ever pulled into that awkward situation you live in an happy make believe world that my child is not interested in any of those things think again perhaps the child has just decided i'll not discuss anything with my parents because they are too awkward because they are stuck up in their some old world and i'm not interested in talking to them at all so grow up parents it's us who has to grow up to match up to them listen to them see their world and then guide them accordingly we have to guide them we have to be strict we have to put down rules we have to help them understand and sometimes we have to stop them from doing certain things which they can which can be harmful for them but for them you have to be standing with them for them you have to be talking in their lingo their language so that they know that my parents understand me and they are doing this for my safety and security so grow up parents do write to me what you feel about this and i'll be waiting for your subscription <laughs>